Growing up, I've always um, idolised uh, Michael Jordan and uh, Muhammad Ali, but um, yeah, probably Michael Jordan. Uh, just his his dominance in basketball and and like not not just uh, during his playing time, but also just as as after after that, just the fact that he was able to leave a massive legacy. Uh, arms, probably trying. Um, I pride myself on having. Um, trying to get big arms, so I've always um, had guys around me who've had massive arms, so I've always tried to match them, so yeah. Fair enough. I highly doubt that. I highly doubt that. Um, yeah. I think sharks are made to swim fast, not humans. <laughs> um, to be honest, I think it's a slick here, do we? He's... Um, He's, he's got this whole new um, slick back hairdo going on, so I think it's just helped him um, run fast, and I think it's just helping him score tries. I've seen I've seen some photos of him from the past, and um, he had some long locks that might have been holding him back. So the fact that he's got this slick haircut going on now, so if you want to score tries, get a Ross Betty. <laughs> That's a tough question. We've got quite a lot of um, quality players in our team. But I think um, the best bath player, I reckon um, Luke Charteris is, um, would be up there, even though um, I reckon he'd be up there. It's just um, his skill set as a, as a lock is um, pretty good and obviously just he's, um, he gets quite a bit of work done in, um, during the week or, or during the game and things like that so he's up there. But I reckon uh, Lou Chatteris or um, probably uh, Semesa, Rokotaguni. He can score some amazing tries and just um, his ability with the ball in hand is freakish. So you can't really train that. You know, you never really see him training that kind of stuff. He'll, he'll do practice of stepping every now and then, but everything else I think is just a gift, a gift. So. Semester. Ah, that's a pretty good question, and um, you know, I've always, I've always prided myself on, um, you know, making sure that I don't see the physio too much. But as of late, I've just been in the physio room all the time, so I figure it's something I need to look into. So if you uh, know anybody that's looking for, uh, you know, someone to sponsor, let me know, and um, we can try and make it happen. I probably will say um, Jeffrey Williams. His uh, ability to be able to remain patient um, with the fact that he's got so many other quality players in front of him. And um, uh, he's uh, it's something that I've always, uh, I see as a massive respect for. And so um, just his patience, and but then also um, his, um, his character and just the way he um, um, you know, portrays himself off the field. He's just always uh, someone you want to be around if you want to have a good laugh. So he's he's quite the joker of the team, and so um, he's never he's never um, shied away whether he's in the in the squad or not. He's Who's faster out of Watson and JJ? Far out. I mean, um, everyone's been talking about how Watson's really quick, and I mean he's he's quick, but I think I think JJ is. Um, I think everyone says he's the fastest in the team, so yeah, and what I've seen lately, he's pretty quick, so JJ.